Let's look at the differences between the off spinner and the leg spinner, as well as which art is more effective in the game of cricket on Hogs Vlog. Well, let's look at the off spinner first. What variations have they got? Well, they've got the normal off spinner. Then they've got the top spinner, where the seam is presenting itself towards the batsman, where it gets extra drop and extra bounce. Then they've got the cannonball, where they put that middle finger on the uh, bottom of the ball there, and they flick it off that middle finger, and it turns the other way. They've got arm balls, one where they bowl with a square seam. Every now and then, that will turn massively but generally it will go straight on, especially in Western conditions. They've also got another arm ball where they put that middle, uh, that spinning finger on the seam as such, and it goes down like a seam delivery. The other one that Nathan Lyon has introduced is the back spinner. Now, he just bowls the back spinner with a thumb on the ball, at the back of the ball, and instead of going over the top, he just brings it back like that, and hopefully that skids and hurries the batsman up out the other end. Now, the leg spinner. What variations have they got? They've got the normal leg spinner. They've also got the top spinner, but they've got the wrong one out the back of the hand. They've got two types of back spinners. They've got the one which looks like a leg spinner that just flicks out in front of the hand like uh, so. But the other one, they've got the two fingers there, which they bowl a bit like a seamer, but instead of bowling the normal seamer, they just bring the hand down the back of the ball as such, and that helps to skid on. And they've got the flipper as well. So both arts have got good variations. Now let's look at the wrist work of both. The off spinner. He's only got a short amount of uh, wrist work that he can operate with as such, just to get that those revolutions on the ball. Whereas the leg spinner can utilize the whole wrist. Now that is why you see leg spinners having a lot more revolution on the ball than the off spinners. I think it's about 2,800 revolutions per second that Shane Warne and Stuart McGill had, whereas Nathan Lyon gets 2,000. So there's an extra 800 revolutions between those two types of bowlers. Now, let's look at the difference between the bowlers with the uh, work that they get off the, uh, off the wicket. Now, if we're in Western conditions, because the leg spinner has got so much overspin on the ball and more revolutions, he's more effective. He gets extra bounce and he gets the extra turn on those uh, type of wickets. But because the off spinner doesn't, generally it's more work in the air, a little bit of drift where the off spinner is trying to bamboozle a batsman in uh, Western conditions. And if you're not getting that overspin, uh, you're not going to get the turn. Whereas when you go to the subcontinent where it's low and slow, the off spinner becomes more effective. Yes, they've got those uh, the normal off spinner, but when you bowl that slider with a side on seam, this is where the likes of Harath, Nathan Lyon, Ashwin, Jadeja come into, into play because those side spinners grip into the pitch and get massive turn. But every now and then, it goes straight on as well. Very hard for the batsman to pick up. So if you're looking at it, there's not really much difference. Both are very effective uh, uh, arts in the game of cricket and both can be very effective on any type of wicket. For me, I prefer to bowl the leg spinner, and I'll show you why. Firstly, this is the off spinner. I don't get over the top like a Nathan Lyon. I generally undercut it. So here we go. See, that didn't turn. Now, look at the leg spinner. See how much more turn I'll get on the leg spinner. That turns massively, and there's extra bounce here. This wicket here is more like Western conditions, but in, over, in Asian conditions, I wouldn't probably get as much turn as that the off spinner would. And just remember, the off spinner can be more effective with his accuracy than a leg spinner because they have limited variables with their rest work. But I hope you like that little uh, dissection of the, the difference between off spin and leg spin. Uh, if you enjoy what I do, give us a little like downstairs, but more importantly, you know what to do to get the notifications when the next video is coming out. Stay safe, enjoy your cricket.